होटल फुटप्रिंटिंग टूल ड्राफ्ट स्क्रिप्ट मॉड्यूल वन इंट्रोडक्शन द करंट ग्लोबल वार्मिंग ट्रेंड कॉज्ड बाय इंक्रीज्ड एनर्जी यूज बाय एन एक्सपैंडिंग इकोनॉमी एंड पॉपुलेशन हैज क्रिएटेड अवेयरनेस सराउंडिंग कार्बन फुटप्रिंट्स दिस इज डिफाइंड एज द टोटल सेट ऑफ ग्रीन हाउस गैस इमिशंस कॉज बाय एन ऑर्गेनाइजेशन इवेंट प्रोडक्ट और पर्सन as the hotel and events industries continue to grow at an exponential rate the need to calculate and communicate the carbon footprint of a guest stay or meeting or event in a uniform way was necessary the hotel industry came together to develop a common way to measure and report on the carbon footprint of a guest stay or meeting the hotel carbon measurement initiative hcmi which enables hotels to report the carbon footprint per occupied room and per area of meeting space per hour but hoteliers corporate customers and online travel agents wanted to know how they could calculate their business travel footprint and how they could gather reliable hotel footprinting data this led to the development of the hotel footprinting tool the hotel footprinting tool provides a free an easy to use way of generating reports for the carbon footprint for an individual or company the tool is based on two modules with complementary purposes the benchmarking module provides benchmarks for energy use and carbon emissions data for hotels in locations where data is available the footprinting module generates a report for your particular usage of hotel stays and meetings in a single or multiple destinations the base data are taken from the cornell hotel sustainability benchmarking tool chsb 2015 data set for benchmarking energy use and carbon emissions data for hotels in specific locations are provided where data is available for footprinting we extrapolated data for more countries using the global average hcmi input values then extrapolated based on the variance in each country's electricity emission factor provided by the international energy agency we will be launching the hotel footprinting tool version 2 in the fall of 2016 as more data has become available for more information on the data and methodology please visit the faq section by clicking on either the benchmarking or footprint modules and look for the question mark circled in yellow on the bottom left to access the online tool go to www.hotelfootprints.org no login information is required to launch the tool let's start with the benchmarking module click launch tool then click the benchmarking button This will bring you to a global map. You will notice several colors are displayed which represent the various measures, while the grayed out areas represent regions where there are no data. The given footprints are derived from the Cornell Hotel Sustainability Benchmarking Study, thus based on average results for each geography. This means that though you are able to enter in specific locations, the values displayed will be for the geography in which the location is found not a specific hotel to begin using the benchmarking module click on the benchmarking button in the lower right corner to select a location there are three options to search for benchmarks you can click on the map enter in coordinates or enter the address to search a location by clicking on the map click on the click map button then click on the map where the property is located note you can zoom in and out of the map to find your location easily to search by entering in coordinates then click enter coordinates a coordinates details box will appear where you can enter the property's latitude and longitude finally to search by entering an address then click enter address an address details box will appear where you can type the property's street address city state or country then select the metric you would like to benchmark by clicking on the measures button on the bottom right this will take you to a dialog box 
where you can select a measure you would like to benchmark. Each contains a description of the different measures. For each measure, there is a color-coded scale ranging from very low to very high. The measures represent various commonly used intensity metrics including those requested in RFPs for energy and carbon, including HCMI metrics for room stays and meeting space use. For this demonstration, we will select HCMI Rooms Footprint Measure to find benchmarks for the carbon footprint of a hotel room night generated by the HCMI methodology. Note that you can choose between six measures and the tool will calculate the data based on your preference. For example, if you choose hotel energy usage per occupied room, kilowatt hour, the tool will generate the range of total energy usage divided by the total occupied rooms for hotels chosen geography and hotel class in kilowatt hours. The measures include HCMI rooms footprint per occupied room kg CO2 E hotel carbon footprint per room kg CO2 E hotel energy usage per occupied room kilowatt hour hotel energy usage per square meter kilowatt hour hotel energy usage per square foot kilowatt hour hcmi meetings footprint per sqm hr kg co2 e for more information on these measures click on the word measures on the bottom right or click on the faqs button on the lower left side then click on the plus sign next to what are measures under benchmarking under definition section these are aggregated figures for the relevant region or country once you submit your location a data box will appear in the right corner if you wish to refine your search you can search by hotel class but this does not reduce the size of the sample in this case we will stay with all from here you can download results to an Excel or PDF file or print. For more information on hotel class, click on the FAQs button and then click What is hotel class under benchmarking under definitions section. Module 3 Single Footprinting The next portion of this demonstration will cover footprinting. If you are starting from the home page, click Launch Tool, then click Footprinting. If you are starting from the benchmarking module, click the footprinting link on the bottom left of the web page. As mentioned in the introduction, for footprinting, there are a greater number of highlighted countries as we were able to extrapolate data for more countries using the global average HCMI input values, then extrapolated based on the variance in each country's electricity emission factor provided by the International Energy Agency. There are also three options to generate a carbon footprint report for a single location under the footprinting module. You can click on the map, enter in coordinates or enter the address. You can search by entering a location either by clicking the map, entering coordinates or entering an address for a single location. Later on, I will demonstrate how to create reports of multiple hotel stays if an individual or company wants to total up its business travel and meeting emissions to offset or report in a CDP or corporate report. When using the footprinting option, the measures are defaulted to HCMI for rooms and meetings and the segment is defaulted to all. Also, in every location, the range of performance varies widely across hotels. The hotel footprinting tool allows you to choose a statistic based on your estimation of where the hotels fall within that range. By default, the mean, average, is selected. You can choose the statistical value that you would like to use. Then enter the number of rooms that were occupied in that instance. And if you used meeting space, enter the average area of meeting spaces occupied and the duration of time the meeting spaces were used. Note, 
this section is optional and can be left blank if you're only seeking to footprint the room nights. For more information, click on the legend on the bottom right and FAQs on the bottom left. Then click what does statistic mean under footprinting? Let's do an example. In this instance, we have chosen to footprint hotel stay in New York for an event. Let's use the map option to search. Click on click map button. Then click on the map where the property is located. Note, you can zoom in and out of the map to find your location easily. A pop-up window where you can enter in the information to calculate your footprint. Default statistic value is the mean. For this demonstration, I will leave it as the mean. We occupied 100 rooms in total. So type 100 under 2, number of rooms occupied. Next, we used 1000 square meters of meeting space for a duration of 3 hours. So enter 3 in the first box under 3. Then 1000 in the second box under 3, meeting space occupied. Finally, choose the floor area unit. We will select square meters for this example. As we enter the data, the results will automatically populate the carbon footprint for the data entered. As you can see the rooms, carbon footprint was 3.25 metric tons. The meeting carbon footprint was 0.094 metric tons and the total carbon footprint was 3.344 metric tons. You can download these results in either an Excel or PDF file or print them by clicking on the option below. To search by entering in coordinates, click on Enter Coordinates. Then a details box will appear where you can enter the property's latitude and longitude. You can also title the location so you can refer to it in your downloaded files. Finally, to search by entering an address, click Enter Address. An address details box will appear where you can type the property's street address city, state or country. Repeat the steps above to calculate your footprint for a single location. Module 4 Multiple Footprinting If you want to calculate the footprint of several hotels at once, use the multiple footprinting option. It's helpful to watch Module 3 Single Footprinting first. The multiple footprint option can be accessed through the footprinting module by clicking on multiple footprinting on the bottom right of the page. There are two options to calculate the footprint of multiple locations. The first option is to manually add different locations by clicking add record. A box to add a footprint location will appear on your screen. Enter the data manually, then hit save. In order to show figures, click Verify and Calculate. To add another hotel, go to Add Record and add the next hotel. You can continue to add properties using the same steps until all data is entered. Once completed, you can print or download a single report in PDF or Excel files. The second option is to use the Upload Data File feature if you wish to upload multiple properties at once. From the multiple footprinting screen, download the data template in the top left corner. A pop-up will open for a file name, multi underscore footprinting dot XLS. Click OK to save the file to your computer. When you open the file, notice that it will have the data field names in row 1 and a sample record in row 2. These fields are the same inputs in the previous examples of single property footprinting or adding a record one by one in multiple footprinting. You can enter in the street address or for more accuracy the latitude and longitude of the property. You do not, however, have to enter in both address and latitude and longitude. The multiple upload function is useful if you are tracking lodging over the course of the year 
and want to keep a running tally to upload at the end of the year. In this example, I have entered in four locations that have been tracked throughout 2015 for my business travel. Two visits to New York, one to Berlin and one to London. You should try to enter in as much information as possible. However, you can also group them together since these are not specific to one hotel. So, for example, we booked five different hotels but for three nights each during the first New York hotel trip. I'm entering in the total rooms 15 and the total meeting space utilized. Once you're ready to upload, click on Browse and select the file from your computer. Then click Submit. Here you can see that it automatically populated the locations based on the file. Review the data to ensure your information is correct. The more specific your locations and information on the data file, the less chance of error. So, let's say for example, here we just put London in the city and the tool indicated London, UK. However, that was actually supposed to be a stay in London, Ontario, Canada. Click on the Edit Pencil button on the right to change. When you click to edit, the same screen will pop up as when you entered in a new record. Here, you can find the location and change it. If you forgot to include all the information in the data file or there was a problem with the location, the record will be highlighted in red when uploaded. Use the same process as before to correct the information. If there are too many errors, you can also edit the Excel file directly. Then click Re-Upload Record at the top right. You can also delete properties by clicking on the trash icon on the far right. After the data is ready, click Verify and Calculate to get results. You can download these results in an Excel or PDF file. If you still have questions, or want to share your feedback, we would love to hear from you. Please email us at support at the rate hotelfootprints.org and we will get back to you within 24 hours.